Kelsey Carlson, a teenager missing for exactly one month now. Tonight, the chief of police department in southern Minnesota reaching out to the girl on Facebook, hoping his message will bring her home. Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey here with the story. Courtney? Hey, Randy, you know, it's safe to say most Minnesotans didn't know who Audrey Lucas was until today, didn't know she was missing. But a police chief with a large Facebook following and a bigger heart has changed all of that with a single Facebook post. Dear Audrey, you don't know me, but my name is Lee, and I'm a police officer here in Kenyon. A letter addressed to a runaway teenager. And even though I don't know you, I'm worried about you. From a small town police chief with nothing to lose. Um, I don't know your past, and it doesn't matter to me. What matters is your safety, and if you're running from something, that's not going away. The letter has been viewed more than 200,000 times, and thanks to Chief Lee Showlander, the name Audrey Lukish is being shared all over Facebook. You never know. She might think I'm a big goofball and never contact me, or she might reach out and say, yep, it's about time. As very few people understand her situation better than him. I ran away from home at the age of 13, and I took my siblings with, and we all ended up in foster care. Gone for a month now, police in Audrey's hometown of Montgomery, Minnesota, believe she could be in Chief Showlander's city. How amazing. <laughs> There's someone to reach out. He doesn't even know my child. Which is what brought Audrey's mother to the chief's office Wednesday to make her own written plea. Please remember you are loved and how deeply you are missed. You are my sweet baby. It will always be my little girl. On this, her daughter's 16th birthday. Please come home. I love you. Mm. Audrey was last seen February 22nd in her hometown of Montgomery, Minnesota. Police have reason to believe she may now be 45 minutes southeast in Kenyon. The chief's open letter to Audrey has been shared more than 2,000 times and viewed by several hundred thousand. If you have any information, you are asked to contact the Montgomery or the Kenyon Police Department. Randy? All right, Courtney, thanks. 4